your day will not be complete without a perfect hair hi guys linda is in middle here welcome back to my channel i had a friend ask me a question recently she said she, because she bought hair from me but she had a problem whereby it was bone straight hair she bought she had a problem whereby stylist helped her to wash the hair and make the bottom part of the hair to be bald but she came back saying that she doesn't know why the bob is not staying. The bob has straightened back. And I told her that it's not everybody that knows how to bob hair very well. And that is a fact. Even me, I struggled with bobbing hair in the past. But since I invested in getting this new hair straightener that gets very, very well, this straightener gets as hot as it gets to the point of 230 um, Celsius. It gets as hot as 230 Celsius, which is around. 480 Fahrenheit. It gets really hot. You need to ensure that the hair straightener you're using gets really hot. Because if you're using a hair straightener that doesn't get hot, like my old hair straightener right here, when you finish wasting hours trying to bulb your hair, you won't achieve a good result. Let me plug this old hair straightener and straighten this part of this hair so you guys see the difference between what I achieved with this hair straightener on this side. And what I achieved with the other hair straightener. So you know, it's really important that you invest in getting a hair tool that gets very, very hot. Because without a tool that gets really hot, you won't you won't achieve the look that you are that you want to achieve. Okay, so I plug this in. I'm just gonna wait for it to get very hot before I continue. Yeah, it's already getting hot. But um, this two right here. I think this is Equator. The name of the brand is Equator. This hair straightener uh -uh, was not doing it for me at all. It wasn't doing it for me. But this right here is, it gets really hot. So make sure you're not wasting your time using a hair straightener that doesn't get very, very hot. Okay, it's getting kind of warm now, not very hot. Give it one minute to get hot. Then I'll proceed towards trying to bob the side of the hair so you guys get to see the importance of using a tool that is very, very hot. Let me pause the video. So, guys, this, this straightener is hot now, so let me use it on the hair so you guys get to see how the hair reacts to the straightener. So guys, you can see how this side of the hair looks. And honestly, while I was using this hair straightener on this side of the hair, you would literally see the heat steaming out of the hair when I use this hair straightener. I don't know if you guys will catch it, but look at this. Like I legit see heat. Coming out, that's to show you how hot this particular hair straightener is, and you can just see how the hair bobs in and it just flips and falls on my face. Unlike this other one here, you can see a bit of freeziness. This one here is at the hottest, but because the plate of this hair straightener is not even wide enough, unlike this one that gets really wide, you just notice that I get a better result with this straightener right here, unlike this other hair straightener. So with a straightener that is not very good you need to you need to you need to do a whole lot more to get the hair to look a particular way and it and at the end of the day because the tool is not as hot as necessary 
you find that after wasting over one or two hours trying to get the perfect bulb look the bulb falls down quickly because the heat which was the hair the, the pressure that was put on the hair through the heat was not sufficient to make it last for a very long time sometimes you need to go through a lot of pressure to be able to stand the test of time i hope this word i this sentence i use really explains it well so you need to make sure you invest in getting tools that get very hot look out for a hair straightener that gets as hot as um, a 230 celsius particular hair straightener right here is the cloud nine hair straightener invest in getting a tool like this so guys thank you so much for watching this video if you got value out of this if you got value out of this video please make sure you smash the like button give the video a thumbs up share with your friends who are also going to get value out of it and please subscribe to my channel if you're not yet subscribed i love you and i'll see you in the next video so you can see the parts that i use this hair straightener on you can see this other part where i use the cloud nine hair straightener on thanks so much for watching bye and remember be bold have courage live a positive life i'll see you in my next video bye guys